Hello friends and welcome back to another episode of Up Close with Lauren Show and Tell. Today my episode is going to be all about Connell Superboy. Yes, Superboy. Look at this nice artwork here at the back of the box. Connell Superboy. Con L Superboy. Again, if you are here watching this review, thank you so much because I know that this action figure has been reviewed months ago by other uh, toy reviewers, most especially the big ones and most especially the ones in the States. But anyway, I appreciate everything. Let's review this. Let's unbox this. So here he is out of the box, still in the clamshell. I'm just loving the look here. It's very 90s. This is a 90s uh, character. Uh, again, I'm not a comic reader, so I don't really know exactly, but I think it's in part of the reign of Superman. Amazing. I'm still looking for the Eradicator. I don't know if it was uh, McFarlane Toys, Toy Store exclusive. I hope uh, GameStop uh, sells it, you know because that's the only way to actually um, find that if it's a gold edition anyway let us um, carry on with this so of course the action figure is there and the usual trading card and it doesn't have the stand I mean the flight stand just a regular stand like so so here he is Superboy out of the box I'm actually loving this action figure um, the first touch i actually love it can stand pretty efficiently there quickly no problem with the balance and i love the sculpt okay look at that hair look at the five o'clock shadow the high cut undercut and i love that um house of l's insignia there of the jacket the black jacket and even here and it doesn't have a cape I guess it's not supposed to have a cape and love the belt here it looks like a punk rock star isn't he with a accessory here wrap around the leg and look at that boots with ties in the front and this knee pad to break the, monot the monotony of red color love the big S symbol there and very nice There's a five o'clock shadow. Love the face. Nice sculpt. Very nice sculpt. Even the design of the jacket here. Like a zipper. And oh, some paint smudge down here. Side. Yeah, I really wish to have the Eradicator. That's in my wish list. So again friends if you haven't please don't forget to click the like button subscribe button and of course the notification bell button as well and th again thank you so much for joining in my last regular season of up close with lauren show and tell so let's talk about the, the um, articulation articulation very articulated the usual mcfarland toys that you can go around and up so can it fly So, 
not so much on has to have more angle and look down yep sideways sideways arms T pose no problem and turn around you have the bicep as well and you can turn around there you go and bicep articulation double jointed elbows the usual McFarlane right there I'm so relaxed now I can just lay down the sand <laughs> um, torso yeah there's a torso break like so like there there's a torso break okay like that and also waist articulation see very nice you can do the splits like there and like here double jointed knees and you have the updated uh, joint here for the foot it's all um, tapered and sculpted nice boots and the toe articulation very nice and you have of course the fist here um, still kind of like in a bull joint but an improved version of it and the hand other side the same thing lovely lovely action figure so here's Superboy waving goodbye to us. <laughs> Bye, Superboy. Okay, look at those spikes again. I forgot to um, mention that. Nice action figure. Okay, friends. Time to say goodbye. From up close with Lauren, show and tell. Thank you again for coming, for joining me. And thank you for discovering my humble channel. Okay. And like what you should say, always be kind to yourself, always be kind to other people. Love your toys, love your collection, no matter what they are. Until the next episode, goodbye!